is everyone, and welcome back to a new ASMR gaming news Fortnite daily item shop video. So let's take a look what's new on the item shop. Oh, Raptor is back. See, is going to be happy. <laughs> and we have a new skin deadlock. Whoa, okay, we have a lot of new stuff, actually. Uh, if you're picking anything up, be sure to use code A S. MR Gaming. Every few weeks it makes you put it back in. So there we go. Go to ASMR Gaming on the item shop and let's check out this new skin. Deadlock. Whoa. This looks like the Matrix. Look at his glasses. Okay, I'm already buying it because I love the Matrix. Any hacker related skins is an automatic buy for me. Whoa. Are you seeing his sunglasses right now? Look at that. There's like code. Oh, that's so cool. The green and the black honestly looks kind of interesting. Apparently there's a new Matrix movie coming, so I wonder if there's going to be a Fortnite and new Matrix movie collab. They did one for John Wick, so who knows. Oh, I like the shoes. The shoes are kind of nice. What's on the... What in the world? He's like jacking into the Matrix. Oh, that that's cool. I like this. Okay, I'm going to be... I can't wait to use this skin in the game now. Break in without getting your hands dirty. Part of the crypto collective set. Ah, oh, so he's, he's into crypto. <laughs> uh, let, let me see the back plane. Was it letting me switch? Okay, here we go. Your bag is your passport. What? Oh, so it's like, okay, I understand, I understand. Okay, that's pretty cool. I like the black and green colors. It kind of reminds me of the, um... Uh, what was the, what was the season four final skin again? Let me, let me just go back, because I, I completely forgot. Uh, what was the name, what was the name, what was the name? Come on, come on. I can't believe I'm forgetting the names of skins now. That's over here, over here, Omega skin, yeah. Like the green, the green and black on the Omega skin. That's what this color, like, scheme reminds me of. So I bet, like, Omega-related stuff will work great with this. Like the back bling. Uh, huh, hack, pack, back bling, deadlock, I like this skin, I'm gonna be using it, here is the code axe, I, uh, interesting play on words, so it's like an axe, it has to do with code, <laughs> codex, code axe, okay, break the code with this axe, that looks very cool, just saying it's already animated, there's zeros and ones on that, let's see what else, Unique animation, yes, and I like the sound, so we're buying it. And I'm running out of V-Bucks, so <laughs> oh, hopefully I have enough for the wrap now. Because I saw there was a new wrap. Oh, I love the animation, it's like a green explosion. And then there's like code running through this, sound is good, I like the design. I like this crypto collective set, it's nice. Let me know what you what you all think in the comments, I like, I like this guy's glasses the most. They look so cool and interesting. So mysterious as well. I, I like this on his neck here. You know, he's like jacking into the matrix or something, hacking in. I don't know. Looks cool. I like this. Good skin. Let me check out the wrap over here quick. Crypto collective set as well. Uh, hmm. I wish the green was just slightly darker. It's more of a light green. It looks a little bit weird. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest. I really like this set so far. I don't know if I'm feeling the wrap. Because the green is just a little bit off. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. If it was like a darker green, I feel like I'd be more enthusiastic. Uh, let me know in the comments what y'all think. Should I still get this? I'm not really feeling the wrap color. It looks more like a mm, light green. Uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to skip that. But it's okay. It goes with the set code green. I think that with this and everything it probably looks amazing. Bunny Wolf is still here, by the way. Amazing skin. Highly recommend. Two, well, three edit styles, basically, because you can choose whether to have it so it switches or so it stays on one permanently. So you have a wolf, you have a bunny skin, neon colors, part of the neon jungle set. Your animal power glows through Bunny Wolf. Comes with the art grid back bling, has like a keychain thing that's animated it will move around advanced construction for maximum heart 
1,400 V-Bucks. It's a reactive skin. It will change in-game. So, really cool. Uh, special skin for sure. I recommend you pick this up if you like it, because I don't know when this is coming back again. Uh, ne Neon, Neonimal. So it's Neon Animal. Part of the Neon Jungle set. Love this. I have this one equipped currently, I think. If I remember correctly, I equipped this. I love the colors on it. Looks very cool. It goes great with this. So, recommend this wrap. Definitely better than the code green one today. And then here is Lion. So, you can either choose between Bunny Wolf or Lion. Lion is a mixture of llama and lion skin. Or you can have, like, one permanently so it doesn't switch it up. Because when you switch from Harvesting Tool to your weapon, uh, the skin changes. But you can also change it out so it stays on one permanently. Prowl, the Neon Knight. Comes with the diamond grid back bling. It has like a keychain of a llama on it. Kind of cool. Uh, honestly, though, I think the hard grid back bling is a little bit better. High tech and high stakes. So that is all here today. So over here we got the assault bomber. Bombs away. Introduced in season nine. Uh, I always thought this was a pretty cool glider, especially if you have like the raptor skin or something. Just because you know he's a pilot and everything. Uh. It's even, like, smoking out the front here, so I think it's about to crash. So I always thought that was, like, a nice little effect. But, yeah, 1,200 V-Bucks, epic. Uh, glider, definitely more on the expensive side, but it looks really cool. It's, like, a legit airplane. Anyone else miss airplanes when they were in Fortnite? I wish they bring planes back again. Party Animal Harvesting Tool, one of the more expensive OG harvesting tools. Red plastic cups. Not included. So it's a thousand five hundred V Bucks. Party animal. It says slurp juice on it. There's like literally a slurp jug keg right here at the edge. It's animated with the slurp juice coming down. I don't know. It makes a really cool sound when you use it too. The animation is special. You have like slurp just flying off it. Nice animation, nice sound. It's very big. It's like a huge design though. <laughs> Uh, if you use the big Chuggis, uh, skin, that, that looks great with this, by the way. That combos, like, perfectly with this. Watch some people do it. But yeah, part of the Slurp Squad set, so that's back. I don't know why this is here, because this isn't really Raptor's harvesting tool, but okay. Uh, here is Raptor, Royal Air Force Test Pilot, introduced in Season 1. So he has two edit styles, the Glow and the regular version. All you C-Day fans out there probably prefer the regular version, though. Uh, it's iconic at this point. It's been the game for such a long time. People love the skin. It's a fan favorite. And C-Day even made it more popular now, so I'm sure lots of people are buying this one today. Here is the Back Bling Raptor Satchel Royal Air Force Standard Issue. I like this Back Bling kind of, you know, it reminds me of someone going on, like, an expedition adventure or something. Definitely goes well with the skin. Royal Air Force Test Pilot. I don't have this one on this account, but on my other account, I do have the Raptor skin because, come on, how can you not have Raptor? It's like, it's one of those classic Fortnite skins like Bright Bomber and stuff. I feel like everyone should have this in their locker. It's a really good legendary skin. Definitely worth it. Here is Velocity, often called the female Raptor skin. Also pretty cool. This one's newer. Came out in Season 9. She's a Royal Air, F Air Force flying ace. Uh, she comes with the bomber bag, smaller back bling than the raptor back bling, but still pretty cool. There's no shovel on this one, high flying, and the colors actually match her pretty well. Like if you notice, look, perfect match, just like the raptor skin back bling really matches as well. Well, except for the green, there's not much green on the raptor skin, they should have made it yellow, but still okay. High flying bomber bag, so that entire set is back. And I still don't know why Party Animal is here. Whatever. <laughs> double Cross is back. Wow, they keep bringing Double Cross back. I've noticed. This is like the second time this month she's come back, I think. Never Turn Your Back, part of the Red Lily set. Uh, I like this skin. I got it during the summer event. She's like a assassin, secret agent or something. So pretty cool. I guess it f fits the theme of this season, you know with uh, Shadow and Ghost and, like, the secret agencies and stuff. Um, cool. Uh, I, I like this one. She has, like, a knife right here on her arm. 
just like a gun right here on her thigh. Also, if you notice the design on this, they're, they're not flowers, there's a skull right there and on the back, so kind of cool. Shows that she is dangerous. Has the floral shell back bling, seaside style. Nice back bling, a little bit hard to combo well. Uh, people have been telling me this looks great on the Shadow Ops, so I need to try that, but nice back bling, definitely summer themed. Armadillo skin is back, okay. This one comes back less frequently than the female version of this, uh, this skin here. Thick skinned and battle hardened, introduced in season 5, 800 V-Bucks. Uh, I like the desert camo on this, but that's about it. Not a big fan of the, his hairstyle here, but to each their own. Uh, okay skin. Okay, definitely, you know, one of the better uncommon skins are some pretty basic ones. This one is right there, like borderline between more basic. It still has some interesting things going on for it, though, with like the bandana, whatever covering his like face and the sunglasses and stuff. Well, yeah, 800 V-Bucks, thick skinned and battle hardened. Island Vibes is back. Strum a happy little tune in Chapter 2, Season 1. This came out, I remember, I got it. Uh, just a happy song. You know, every once in a while, when you're with your friend or something, you're chilling in your base, waiting in top ten for the circle to close. This is a fun emote to just pull out. You know, vibe with your friends or something. <laughs> Island vibes. Uh, good emote, good emote. That, that one brought me a lot of laughs. Disco fever. This is like a classic, but at this point, like, everybody knows this one. Been in the game since season three. Heat up the dance floor. Great music. Uh, that's all I gotta say. I, this is probably one of like the famous Fortnite emotes at this point. Like everybody knows this one. Dun 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 dun. dun. Yeah. Backstroke is back. Put your back into it. Introduced in season seven. Five hundred V bucks. Uh, I also like this one. Maybe I'm trying to think what the best emote is on the item shop. It's kind of tough. Uh, I, this one's slower. I like the music, though, and I like how the, the footwork, kind of like moving back and forth like that. See? I don't know, it's a nice emote, but a more chill one, kind of slow. Both the Island Vibes and Backstroke, definitely more chill emotes, slower emotes, but they're all really good. I could go on about emotes forever, because you all know I love them so much. And, uh, I just noticed... I own basically everything on the item shop today, with the exception of the, uh, you know, raptor set stuff, maybe armadillo, but yeah, I own, like, a lot of things interesting. But, uh, yeah, thank you all for listening, for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll be back very, very soon with a new ASMR gaming video. So long, and farewell.